Hi, I'm Nicole Smithy from Iridescent Women, and today we're reading Colossians 1.13. For he has rescued us from the dominion of darkness and brought us into the kingdom of the son he loves. There's such a beautiful exchange that we get to receive because of what Jesus did for us on the cross. When he paid the price for our sins and reconciled us to God and gave us the gift of eternal life. I want us to unpack this exchange that is explained in verse 13. Not only do we receive freedom from the dominion of darkness, but also a welcoming into the kingdom of God. What does this freedom mean for us? Well, it means things like shame, addiction, despair, depression, anxiety. Those things that once held us bound when we were under the rule and reign of darkness, we are no longer subject to. As children of God, we've been set free from those things. We no longer have to bow down to those or settle for those things in our lives. No matter how bleak the circumstances are, no matter how difficult the season, no matter what's happening around us or even to us, we can always turn to Jesus and cry out to him because he is the source of our freedom. Freedom is our inheritance. And then there's a belonging that takes place. Not only are we set free, but we are welcomed into the kingdom of God and in this kingdom, it's Jesus who reigns. And his reign is one of grace and truth and mercy and peace and love and hope. That's what we get to live under. That's what we get to receive as children of God. We are not abandoned. We are not alone. But we've been welcomed into the kingdom of God, a part of the family of God, loved, chosen, valued, and purposed by God. So today... I hope you're encouraged by this verse and reminded that God has freedom for you and that you belong to the kingdom of God.